This is Kappa Gaming. Today we're trying one state. Uh, pretty much I'm gonna show you right now uh, the first job, proper first job in this game. It's called the Civilian Taxi. So first things first, you need to go to development tree, make sure you first did the delivery service and then you need to mark it on the map and go over there. Okay. And then you need to make sure you actually open the map, the main map. Go to Legends and go to Driving School because you will need a driver license. If you wanna know how hard is the driving uh, school, you can check the other videos on the channel. So first we go right here. We don't actually have a car so we need to rent it, but I already rented it earlier. So the rent price of the car is $1,500 per hour. Per hour? Jesus Christ! I don't know if it's per hour in game, I really hope it's per hour in real life, that's all I'm gonna say, 1,500. But either way, make sure you have at least 1,500, which... Okay, we get into the taxi car. And then we're waiting for a beautiful order from a passenger. Uh, don't worry, the moment we actually get an order, it will pop up on the screen to accept it or not. So you can either literally stay right here, or just cruise around a little, you know. There you go, order found. The thing is, in the job description, it says that the taxi driver uh, situation, you get paid by kilometers, or so not necessarily back. Uh, right, so by by kilometers, so I don't know if it's that me driving towards the client or the where exactly the client wants to go, so let's see, the first client is 1500 fucking meters away, so it's gonna be a long ass drive, thank god this is a nice car, as you can see the driving is actually very nice in this game with a proper car. You can also buy your own cars, but those are kind of expensive. Uh, my best advice right now would actually be to follow the uh, to follow the waypoint because I tried this earlier and I kind of uh, didn't follow it and I got stuck on railroads and I got uh, the car stuck as well and it's it was a horrible situation for me to go all the way back and back again just to start the job again by losing money and so on. So let's see how much you can actually earn as a taxi driver in this Los Angeles city. Frena, frena. All right, we managed to hold it up a little. Can also move the camera. Oh, we actually have people. Okay, they actually got inside. Okay, that's amazing. So look at the NPCs, they're right there. So the NPC spawn where the, they're gonna wait for you to get them to the destination. Okay, perfect. So right now their destination is quite decent. It's 1,300 meters. Okay, so let's see how much we get for our first fare. As you can see, till level 4 we need 6,000. Oh shit, we need 6,000 in total. We got 1,124 experience points. And let's see, we're gonna do a couple of, um, gonna do a couple of, uh, what the fuck, uh, fares and see how much we earn because we already know how much we earned on the first job, the first level and second level of the first job. And if you want to know how much you do that, you could uh, check the other video on the channel as well to learn that. As you can see, it's right left, we could have gone through the bit near the streets right there to the building and get to the waypoint faster but again you're paid by the mileage so best option follow the long road <laughs> follow the long run i guess the the longer the ride is the longer they will have to pay so if you i'm gonna try to be a jackass to see if i can um one of these days literally drive around the entire map and then get them to the point to see if I break the game and make like one million dollars. <laughs> that would be nice. Huh? 
Okay, now we need to go left. Oh, I see they gone to Vinewood, the ex uh, the expensive part of town. This game has a Vinewood. It looks very nice. Literally looks like GTA 5 Vinewood, that's all I'm gonna say. Damn, it looks fucking awesome though around here. Damn, they're going to a giant ass fucking mansion. They should give me some tip for this ride. Okay, let's see how much we made. Our first ride. $2,239 with a tip of $13. Jesus Christ, $2,300 with a $13 tip! Damn! That's fucking amazing! Okay, we're accepting the other order right now. Oh, 1,114 meters. Okay, let's... Uh Let's go and grab our passengers and this time I'm being a little bitch and I don't want to drive all the way around so we're gonna crash it a little. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Perfect. We drove down the hill so uh, that's amazing. So I'm gonna stop after this second uh, customer speaking up. I think going to pick them up you can shortcut it if you know where to go and make sure you don't get stuck in some stairs. So we're just uh, driving through the streets right here, through the back alley, so we can reach them a little faster. Because it shouldn't matter how uh, long you take to get to them, you shouldn't get paid by that. Like in real life, you don't get paid by how long the driver has to drive to pick you up. <laughs> You'll go bankrupt if that was the truth, right? So that means we're just gonna fuck. Yeah, we're not gonna fuck, but still. Okay, 500 something meters, and we're gonna go through this street right here. Oh, thank god, it's an extra street. Okay, and when we pick their asses up, haha, <laughs> we're gonna drive all the way to the bank. Oh, yeah, it's definitely worth it. 1500 per hour with the taxi. Uh, that means we literally made two hours to drive this car without a problem, so with a profit of $13. Pure profit, I meant. Okay, hello ma'am, get inside, please. Thank you ma'am. Now let's see how far away we need to deliver her ass. We need to deliver her ass 300 meters away. Ah, I'm guessing it's gonna be a very, 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 very cheap ride, right? Uh, we deliver her to the parking area, so she could get her car. We got $1,000 with a $6 tip. Did you hear me? Yeah, $6, but $1,000 the, uh, the ride. Let's go pick up the third fare and then the video will be over. You got the idea of how much you make. The only thing that is kind of fucked up and... Uh, I think is gonna kind of fuck with all my plans. Um, you don't actually get XP points for doing this. Because it doesn't uh, give me any XP points. It only gives me the money. It's kind of fucked up. Let me just double check. So right now we're at 1,124. So until 6,000 the next level. So let me check that. Let me double check the book as well just to make sure. Development tree. 
Huh, it seems it kind of gives us some XP, but it doesn't actually appear how much XP we got. I'm gonna double check after we do this. So 1,124. And let me just double check the book as well. The book should be... Uh, we need 4,876. For four thousand, so four thousand eight hundred seventy-six for the next level in the job description. So right now we're gonna quickly deliver this. Uh, we're gonna quickly pick up the customer. This is gonna be an entire series of me trying every goddamn job in this game, and then when the houses actually appear, launches in the game. We're gonna have some amazing fun with it by trying to buy the most expensive house in the game, huh? Like get rich quick schemes if you really wanna go that way. <laughs> okay, let me just go. Ah, fucking houses everywhere, goddammit. By the way, if you rent the car and you hit and shift, you will remain on foot. So if you wanna remain on foot, I advise you to go near a parking uh, a, a P sign so you can spam your car and don't end the shift until you reach that because... Uh, well, let's just say it's gonna hurt your ass. You know what I mean? Hmm? We also have a v used vehicle market, right? If you wanna, uh, right? If you wanna get some cheap vehicle, use the used ones. They're kind of mediocre, but I don't know if you can actually drive without a taxi, like a proper taxi, or you just need to have your own car. So the next one, holy shit! I wonder how much is gonna be. It's two thousand meters until we need to drop them off. Huh? No, the first one was 1,200. This one is literally 2,000. So, the first one we made 2k something, so that means we should make at least 4k, right? So, in theory, let's hope we make a lot of cash. Okay, let's do this. We're, uh, we're almost there. So it seems the car you're renting does not actually make kilometers. So the gadget doesn't actually go up. So that's, that's nice, I guess. So it means, uh, I think they're kind of, uh, I think it was a writing mistake in the game. So you don't actually get paid by kilometers. You get paid by how long you drive, I think. I mean, I, I guess it's pretty logical, right? I don't know bro, it's it's weird. I got literally a ride for 300 meters and I got 1k. I don't know. And 1k is quite a lot of money for literally 300 meters, right? Shit, a real life player with a scooter, he almost hit us. We're just gonna try to ignore his stupid ass right there. I think he was shocked to see a taxi in this game because uh, <laughs> there's not a lot of players online. So I'm guessing maybe that's why. He literally tried to put the brakes and get in front of me. I don't know exactly his game plan, but to each his own, to each his own. Okay, we're almost at the destination and I know what everybody's thinking. Why are you not uh, going straight it? Why are you... Why are you going the long route where the game tells you to go? What you doing? Why are you not going faster? Deliver it faster. No. We need to add the miles. So if we add another 5 to 6 miles, 30, 300 miles or something like that, we should be getting paid more, right? Exactly like in real life. The longer you fuck around on their uh, money, the more money you make. Like, God damn it, you know? So that's what we're trying right now. We're just 
taking our sweet ass time to deliver the passengers to their Beverly Hill mansion. Okay, let's see how much we got. $2,630 with 50 cents. We still got 1,124 at the level. Let's quickly check the book. 4,876. Yeah, so you don't actually make any XP. Yeah, so you don't actually make any goddamn XP. With the taxi driver. This kind of sucking because... Uh, it's a great way to actually make a lot of money with the taxi, but at the same time, you don't want to get stuck at the taxi, right? You cannot, uh, you cannot even go to the, um, what's the correct uh, line I'm looking for? You don't uh, even get to go with the second tire of the taxi driver, like to get even more money. Yeah, so you need to do the first mission like I uh, showed you, the second tire, uh, tire of it, a couple of times until you actually get to... Always just check literally the book until you actually reach like level 7. On level 5 you get the last delivery service that means you even get more money and the second delivery taxi will be at level 7. Yeah, I, I guess uh, you understand how you go right now so I hope you guys like thanks for watching don't forget to leave a, uh, an amazing like an amazing comment and uh, you know, like, 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 like.